Good day to you. I hope you're having a good Monday. I decided I'd set up here by the scripture window uh, here in the foyer uh, today because I want to tell you an old favorite story of mine. It involves uh, the Bible and our nation. Uh, Sir Leonard Tilley was born not, not far from here in Gagetown, New Brunswick. Uh, that was in 1818. Uh, Tilly Hall at UNB is named after him. Uh, there's even a Tilly House in Gagetown. Uh, he sat as a representative in the New Brunswick legislature, uh, but he's best known as New Brunswick's father of confederation. Leonard loved the Lord and sought to serve him while serving the public uh, by serving the people of New Brunswick. Uh, while he was at the British North America con conference, uh, the discussion turned to what this new uh, united nation called Canada would actually be called. Uh, the discussion was continued into the next day. Before the session th that day, Tilly, uh, as he would often do, uh, read his Bible in his room. That was his usual custom. He would read uh, a chapter each day before he began his duties. That day, uh, he was reading Psalm 72, and in that uh, he read, He shall have dominion from sea to sea, and from the river unto the ends of the earth. Well, that got him thinking. So when he went back to the session that day, he suggested uh, that Canada be called the Dominion. And so during the discussion, it was decided that our nation would be known as the Dominion of Canada as a result of a faithful man who faithfully read his Bible and who noticed there uh, this, great, uh, this great theme, this great name for, for a nation. We are the Dominion of Canada. You know, Psalm 72 goes on to, uh, to end this way. It says, all nations will be blessed through him and they will call him blessed. Praise be the Lord God, the God of Israel, who alone does marvelous deeds. Praise be to his glorious name forever. May the whole earth be filled with his glory. Amen and amen. I'm praying that our nation will be filled with his glory. I'm praying that our nation will be filled with people who are blessed by him, uh, by the one who is known as the Lord, the one who has dominion not only over this nation, but who has dominion over the entire earth. Let's give him our praise today, and let's be submitting to him. I hope you have a great day, and God bless you.